All right, well, hello there. It's daytime, <laughs> unlike yesterday. <laughs> if you saw yesterday's vlog, it was not daytime when I started really doing the vlog. Uh, but it is uh, just a little afternoon, and it is uh, Tuesday, March 26th. And uh, let's see, morning sale, check and um, emails checked, uh, comments check, <laughs> what else? Table set uh, and ready to talk about the morning sale, check. Uh, yeah, so I've been getting a lot of the computer work done. Let's see, I had some breakfast, uh, Joe, I don't know. He had second breakfast at first. He was like, mm, no, this isn't what I want. But after a couple attempts, he did finally eat it. <laughs> he is, um, he's being really funny now about the uh, refrigerator food. And I'm like, I'm sorry, Joe, but sometimes we have to eat the cold refrigerator food along with the fresh food. Um, I haven't gotten to the point of trying to microwave his food to warm it up yet. We'll see, because he does eventually eat it. <laughs> He's just being silly. Uh, Faye, on the other hand, eh, she nibbles. She grazes all day. She's she's so much easier. <laughs> um, all right, but we're all fed. We're ready to go. Um, let's see. Oh, uh, in part of doing the comments and emails, um, there are some additional items that have sold. Uh, so we will talk about those after we do the, um, the morning sale. So let's go ahead. I'm going to turn over here and let's see. For the morning sale, I brought 55 items to the sale. I sold 41, uh, which means there are 14 items still available. So let's go ahead and look at those uh, 14 items. I'm gonna turn this around. Boom, there they are. There are the 14 items that are still available. There, I'm gonna move my sheet out of the way for just a second. There we go, there's the cute assortment. Uh, so I did bring jewelry and I brought some plush. Um, I was running a little late on time yesterday. If you guys saw the vlog, you know, things didn't quite go as planned. Uh, but that's okay. I got done what I needed to get done yesterday, and things are running smooth today. Um, mostly with my email. Um, yeah. But <laughs> that's all. It's all good today. Uh, so let's see. I had four pieces of jewelry remaining after the sale. First up is this ring. It's got a really cool uh, circles design. It is a size five, so it's a little smaller, size five, and that is a $2. This one, black and silver tone, it is a size six, and it is also $2. Uh, this one, oh, Oh yeah, this one, the um, kind of the whitish with some little speckles on it. That one is a size eight and a half and it is $2. And then this one, it's gonna be really hard to see. Let me see if I can get it into some better light and get it to focus on it. Nope, that's not light. Let's get up here. There we go. It is a little hard to see, but to me, it looks like it is red, white, and blue. Really cool. Uh, it is a size uh, five and a half, and it is $2. All right, so that's the jewelry that's remaining. Uh, the Britannia. This is a McDonald's Britannia, and uh, still in the original packaging. He is $3. And then we've got the um, Cheeks, the Mandrill, uh, $4. Stilts, the Stork, 
$4. Spike the Rhino, $4. Nanook the Husky, $4. Bruno, um, some kind of a terrier, $4. Lizzie the Lizard, $4. A larger Britannia, $4. Um, oh, and then I have two Funkos. Uh, so the tiger is Raja from Aladdin, and that is $4. And then this is a little bat from the uh, Wetmore Forest, and his name is Bugsy Wingnut, and he is $4. And then the last one is this little guy named Huey. He's a little dog. And Huey is $5. All right, so those are the 14 items that are still available. There we go. Okay, now let's go ahead and take a look at the 41 items that sold. Um, a few necklaces. This one is fun. It's a resin necklace, but it is black light reactive, so it does have a really cool glow. Uh, this one was a 40 inch necklace that could also double as a belt. Uh, some rings and some earrings. And uh, four different stone bracelets and this really pretty key necklace. Now there are little rhinestones all around the top of the key and on the, um, oh gosh, I don't know what to call that, that part. <laughs> and then uh, the plushes that sold. I had a lot of the little McDonald's, uh, but they all had their uh, tags on them. I don't have them showing all that way, but they do have their tags. Two different turtles. They are so cute. The, ooh, oh, the spider. I am so glad that's going out of the house. <laughs> you know, I don't like those. <laughs> Not even the plush ones. Uh, had a Boyd's Bear Rabbit. Yeah, so that wasn't a Boyd's Bear, but it's a rabbit. Had a Coca-Cola. Uh, had the uh, Maple Britannia and Glory. And that one, not a Boyd's Bear, but kind of looks like it. And a, uh, a Thai Dumbo. All right, so those are the 41 items that sold today. Now I'm going to go ahead and switch the camera around and we'll talk about the additional items that sold. All right, so I am over at the counter now um, and these were part of the hearts, kind of the unofficial themed sale that I had yesterday. Uh, but these were heart items that I had available. Now, I do still have more that are available. Uh, so if you like heart-themed items, um, go ahead and take a look at my vlog from yesterday, and you will see more. But these uh, five items have sold. Um, and I'm going to update you on an eBay sale. Um, so I do have, and, and eBay kind of has you do returns anyway, um, but this was the uh, Loom State pair of jeans that sold last week. Um, they were received, they didn't like them, didn't fit, whatever, and so they sent them back. Um, and so I have them now relisted and I'm gonna put them, now I sent them out in a plastic bag, which I always do. They came back without the plastic bag. It's like, okay, <laughs> so I'll get another plastic bag, I'll put them in there, and then I will um, put them in the little bin, and we'll wait for them to sell again. Uh, but that is kind of part of doing things, uh, selling things on eBay, is sometimes you get returns, that's all right, it happens. 
you list it again. It's really, they make it really easy. When you do the refund, you push the button and it automatically relists it. So it is really nice. You don't really have to do a lot of work. Um, I do also cross list on Poshmark. And so I did here, I'll flip this around here. Um, so I do cross list on Poshmark. A lot of things are also cross listed on Mercari, although Mercari doesn't do much for me um, in terms of sales. Um, so I did have to relist this on Poshmark, but that's really easy. I do use Flip. Um, so the information was already in Flip. All I had to do was basically hit the button and they were cross-listed again on uh, Poshmark. So super easy to do. Um, but I'm gonna take that upstairs with me because that is where I store everything for sale. Tuck them away in their bin and have them wait for the next time they sell. The other items, yep, I need to clear off this table. And so I'll be taking the sold items upstairs with me. Yes, I am still keeping things organized by person. That system is still working. And uh, so, yeah, I am able to maintain that. Uh, the unsold items, well, they're going to stay down here, easy access. So as people watch the sale, the speed round, and watch the vlog, if there's any additional interest in purchasing, then I can easily have access to them until the next time I bring them to a sale. Um, I need to, for tomorrow... Uh, get my 10 items for the morning sale. Um, we'll see if I can get organized enough to get the items for the afternoon sale. I usually don't <laughs> because I'm going to be spending the bulk of today upstairs doing some packing and invoicing. Um, mail count for today is actually zero. Um, oh, I forgot to to check how many packages I have um, to go out. Let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna say nine packages in my holding area, eight or nine, eight or nine packages. I did get a payment this morning, um, so I will get that ready to go out tomorrow. I will request USPS pickup tomorrow. Um, and then any other payments I get in, those will get added to, uh, tomorrow also. Um, but yeah, that's where we're at today. No mail pickup. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. That's what tomorrow's for too. Um, all right. So I am going to get going on, um, organizing the table, um, and, uh, get myself upstairs for a fun afternoon of packing and invoicing. Um, but that is pretty much going to wrap it up. Now, if anything else happens, any other sales happen, you'll see on the ticker that I've added more time to this, but otherwise I'm going to say thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow.